I don't want to leave. I want to die. Who will take care of me? I have no job. I don't want to leave. Listen, listen. There is life. There is life after AIDS. I will take care of you. By getting worried, we will reach nowhere. We have to find some solution. I have a doctor friend in Bangalore called Falco Seeger. He has a AIDS research institute. He is also a specialist of infectious diseases. I think I take you there. We go to Bangalore tomorrow. Dr. Seeger here. Hello, Dr. Falco. This is Kamal calling. Hello, Kamal. All is okay? Then come tomorrow at 10 a.m. Thank you so much. See you tomorrow. See you. Suno bhai, wo Dr. Falco ka kamera kidhar hai? Wo side mein. Please come in. Hello Dr. Falco, how are you? I'm quite well. So what happened to him? Salman did a blood test in Goa and report says he is HIV positive. Can I see the report? We don't have it. So we need to do another blood test to be sure. Some other tests and chest x-ray. As you suggest. Yes, the report confirms the presence of HIV virus in his body. And the x-ray suggests tuberculosis infection in his lungs. So what shall we do then? First we will start the TB treatment with antibiotics. Treatment duration will be between 9 months and 12 months. What about HIV treatment then? Now we will do TB treatment. Once you are cured, we will do further diagnosis. And if it is needed, we will start further treatment. Please don't worry. Nowadays, very good treatments are available. HIV is no longer a life-threatening condition. Salman, it will be better if you stay a few months in our rehabilitation center. When I see that you are getting better, then you can go back home. As you say. Please provide the best possible treatment to Salman. That I will do. But the medicines are expensive. Other things will not cost you. The medicine and the other need I will provide. Then there is no problem. Salman will start recovering soon. Salman, look, 1,000 AIDS death in India every day. I think we need to do something about it. I am your friend, but I have to do something for the rest Ashok, we have this fourth floor house lying empty in the center of Bangalore. And 
you being my brother i thought of discussing this issue with you but what you plan to do with this house you know i am involved with hiv aids program and i thought of converting this house into hiv counseling center to inform and help people see india is a huge country how many people one can help i have to tell you one good story once i was walking on the beach and what i saw baba yes there are thousands of starfishes lying on the beach you can't save all of them you are right but i can save this one so the heart of the matter is if we can't help many people in this world it's okay but if we can help just one human being our purpose as human being is served Salman can i ask you one question yes listen it's your prerogative to answer i will not force you go on i wonder how the virus entered in your body oh i tell you i lived a dangerous lifestyle drug sex and party it went on for a long time and often i took risk of not using condom and one night suddenly oh god so much of sweat i'm feeling so warm it's so hot Why bed sheet is so wet? Oh no! What happening? What are these big lumps here? And here also? And I had no courage to even to check what was wrong with me because of my dangerous past. Salman you can do something good in your life now but how we will do aids prevention in india we will inform people how to protect themselves against virus but i have no courage don't lose heart what misery has been inflicted on you you can still do a lot of good out of this bad as long as i am here we will do prevention work together when i am going you will continue to do this hum log aids prevention ke liye kaam kar rahe hain 
आपको एड्स के बारे में तो मालूम हो गए नहीं मालूम सलमान ये कोंडोम एक कोंडोम तुम्हारे लिए एक कोंडोम तुम्हारे लिए एक कोंडोम तुम्हारे लिए एक कोंडोम तुम्हारे लिए ये क्या है ये कोंडोम एड्स को रोकने के लिए काम में लिया जाता है How was your visit to India? It was good, but... But? I have come back with a big responsibility. What responsibility? I have a friend called Salman in India. He got AIDS. As a result, he lost his job and I promised him that I will take care of him all his life. Are you crazy? Responsibility for a lifetime? Tu n'as pas de boulot. Et comment tu vas prendre soin de toi et de ton ami Seulement en donnant des cours de yoga et d'autres petits jobs comme ça So you think I should have let him die Non. Maintenant que tu as promis, il faut que tu tiennes ta promesse. Merci pour ton soutien. Écoute. Il faut que tu trouves du travail rapidement pour pouvoir aider ton ami. Je vais faire de mon mieux. Salut Kamal, tu vas bien Salut Philippe, et toi Oui, bien, bien. Philippe, je te remercie pour m'avoir trouvé un boulot ici. Ça fait plaisir. Trouver un boulot ici, c'est facile. Mais attention, garder son boulot ici, c'est très difficile. Et pourquoi Car le patron, il est dur. Il nous surveille tout le temps et il faut travailler vite. Ah, maintenant j'ai compris. <rire> attention, le patron, il est là. Vous travaillez ou vous rigolez Excusez-moi. C'est le premier jour. Je vais travailler mieux. J'ai pas confiance. On en restera là. Comme vous voulez. Qu'est-ce que tu fais ici, Oli Tu dois être au travail. Listen, Julie. It was a bad place to work. I didn't like the job. Kamal. 
Il n'y a pas de mauvais travail, ni de bon travail. Tous les boulots sont bons. Tu as lu Bhagwad Gita. Qu'est-ce que dit Bhagwan Gita Le travail, c'est la vie. Il faut travailler dans la vie. Michel, I think that's enough for today. Okay. Can I ask you for one help, please? Tell me. So, what can I do for you? You know, I have a friend in India who is HIV positive. At the same time, I'm running a prevention program, but I have no money. How can I help you? I have this watch. And I want to sell it. I bought it for 8,000 francs and I can sell it to you for 4,000 francs. Okay, let me see. But this is 8,000 francs. I ask you just for 4,000 francs. But this is the right price. Oh Michel, you are so generous. Thank you so much. You are very kind. Hello Kamal. The money transfer office is not giving me the money. They says there is a problem. Bonjour monsieur. Bonjour monsieur. Je peux vous aider? Je vous ai appelé pour vous dire que mon ami Anand n'a pas encore reçu l'argent. Oui, je peux avoir la quittance s'il vous plaît? Voilà. Merci. Hmm, il y a un problème monsieur. Et quel est le problème? Votre ami ne peut pas recevoir l'argent tant que nous n'avons pas une preuve de son identité. Et pourquoi? Écoutez, officiellement je ne peux pas vous le dire, mais le nom de votre ami commence par Mohamed Salman. Et ça c'est le problème, parce que c'est un nom particulier. Je ne comprends pas. Écoutez, toutes nos transactions passent par les états unis Une agence du gouvernement surveille toutes ces transactions pour identifier les réseaux terroristes et leur financement. Ni moi, ni mon ami ne sommes des terroristes. 